Every year, many households experience a domestic fire like this one. Some fires result in damage to the property or equipment, but unfortunately, some cause serious injury or prove fatal. This is a reconstruction of an actual incident involving a lady called Sarah who was lucky to escape from the property. Hello, fire service. Hello, I'm calling back my neighbour. So that's three pine way in Belfast, and what's the problem? I can hear the her fire alarm, but I can see smoke through her window. Mobilise, mobilise. Everyone to feel free. Everyone to feel free. After this fire in Sarah's home, she was admitted to hospital to be treated for smoke inhalation. The Northern Ireland Fire and Rescue Service carried out a free home fire safety check, which looked at how Sarah could reduce the risk of fire in her home in the future, and how she could escape if there was another fire in her home. A social worker from Older People's Services and the Belfast Health and Social Care Trust supported Sarah and her family through this process. They looked at the obvious fire risks in the home created by a build-up of newspapers combined with carelessly discarded cigarettes. They also looked at other fire risks in the home including cooking, candles, electrical appliances and portable heaters, as well as ensuring Sarah had working smoke alarms. Sarah was able to return to her home and, two years after this incident, Sarah continues to live safely in her own home. Most accidental fires in Northern Ireland start in the kitchen. Never leave cooking unattended. Keep the oven and grill pan free from a build-up of oils and grease. This could ignite and cause a fire. Keep flammable items such as oven mitts, tea towels, paper and cables away from the cooker top. A candle is an open flame in the home which will ignite any combustible material that it comes into contact with, including hair and clothing. Always use a fire guard on an open fire. Look out for materials that could catch fire being too close to an open fire. Do not sit or stand too close to heaters. Clothing may melt or even ignite. It's important that plug sockets aren't overloaded. Although most extension leads allow enough space to plug in four appliances, this doesn't mean it's always safe to do so. Fires started by smoking materials are the biggest cause of fatal fires in Northern Ireland. You can try to reduce fire risk by ensuring the smoker is using a proper ashtray, encouraging smokers to stub out their cigarettes fully, ensure cigarettes are discarded properly, avoid smoking in bed, recommend smoking outside. Smoke alarms are vital as they provide an early warning of a possible fire within a property allowing more time to escape. Smoke alarms should be tested every week to make sure that they're working. There are many fire risks in the bedroom. Bedside lights like this one heat up if left on. Look out for devices being charged on flammable surfaces. Devices should not be left to charge for long periods of time. Look out for power leads that are frayed or damaged. Recommend they are replaced if necessary. Electrical cables under rugs, carpets or furniture may be damaged or worn, which could go unnoticed. Older people should have a bespoke fire escape plan tailored to their individual needs. 
Northern Ireland Fire and Rescue Service could help you devise this plan during a home fire safety check. This production will help you in identifying fire risks and will hopefully assist and support you in keeping family, friends and neighbours safe from fire. My goal is zero accidental fire deaths in Northern Ireland and I believe we are safer together.